sound absorption and sound insulation are two different concepts related to the control of sound in a given environment. Here's the difference between them. Sound absorption refers to the process of reducing the reflection of sound waves within a space. It involves the conversion of sound energy into heat, typically by using materials that are designed to absorb sound waves. Sound absorbing materials are used to reduce the reverberation or echo within a room, making it sound less live or ringy. This is particularly important in spaces where clear communication or audio quality is desired, such as recording studios, theatres and lecture halls. Common sound absorbing materials include acoustic foam, fiberglass panels, mineral wool and perforated panels. These materials have a porous or fibrous structure that allows them to absorb sound energy as it passes through. Sound insulation, on the other hand, is the process of blocking or reducing the transmission of sound from one space to another. It focuses on preventing sound from entering or escaping a specific area or room. Sound insulation is important in reducing noise transfer between adjacent rooms, buildings or outdoor and indoor environments. It helps maintain privacy and reduce disturbances. Sound insulation typically involves using materials and construction techniques that have high sound transmission loss properties, such as thicker walls, double glazing for windows, sealing gaps and cracks, and using materials with mass density to block sound transmission. For example, by applying a soundproofing membrane with a high specific weight such as isulfon barrier between two gypsum boards in a partition wall, we achieve an increase in sound insulation. By fitting a lead sheet such as isulfon PB to a drainage pipe, noise to the interior of a dwelling will be reduced. In summary, sound absorption deals with reducing sound reflections within a space to improve its acoustic quality while sound insulation focuses on preventing the transmission of sound from one area to another, making it an essential component of noise control in buildings and structures. Both concepts are important for creating comfortable and acoustically suitable environments, but they serve different purposes. Do you have any questions? Don't hesitate to call us.